I don't know who Jax is, but I kind of recognize the name, so it makes me think he's a good player. Dude, I want the Signet, because I don't have anything to do the first few turns. You know the mountain. Alright, he named Green. Wow. He's going to drop like a 6 drop next turn. Wow, I'm just going to compulse. Sigh! All mana. I'd say that's annoying because I have the Drake, but I also have a Fang Tail, so I think I'll be okay. I have a whole ton of mana up. Alright, what are you going to do with that 4 mana? Probably Wrecking Ball my Fang Tail. Or Disembowel. But it's during his turn, so he actually didn't do it with anything that mana during my turn. Oh, interesting. I well, can't really block that because the skyscrapers kill my guy. Oh, interesting. I think he got mana flooded like me. Let's just say I'm not going to be hellbent anytime soon. Scorter is actually good. It gives me temporary flying when the Skysweeper uh, doesn't have mana to activate itself. It's annoying with the Ledge Walker. Ooh, Cronarch for uh, Compulsive Research. That's some insane card advantage there. Yeah, I'll trade a uh, Cellsword Brute for Skysweeper. Didn't like that choice. Actually, ooh, he blocks. That means he's gonna wild size. That card's pretty good. Yeah, he'll probably wild size. Ido shape. Nah. Actually, I'd rather have him have Saito shape and not that other card. Wild size. Because wild size, uh, dr uh, cantrips. So on the surface, he's playing the same colors I am <laughs> black, red, green. Every color besides white. Although he doesn't know I don't actually have. I guess I could have traded for the Skysweeper there. I guess he wouldn't have been able to cast Savage if, if I had I done that. I've, I've got the Brute to chump block. Nice. What do I want to kill? The Drake or the Skysweeper? The Drake. Because he can only sky sweep. No, no, he can sky sweep multiple times. Nothing on my board actually has flying right now, right? He kept the uh, ledge walker back. Did I do that during his turn? Oh my goodness! Oh, I've got the win. Oh, no, no, the Starflash has reach. I didn't do my math, but hopefully, hopefully it works out. I forgot this can give that trample. Oh, my goodness. All right, I've got six toughness. He's got 11 trampling. So hopefully I'm safe, but who knows. So if he has a flyer, I'm just screwed. I mean, if he had a trick, he would have used it and trampled over for the win. Ah! No, that's, no, that's fine. That's not a flyer. I can fly in for the win. His last gas. Why do you even show me the Plax mana? All right. So you need to kill two flyers with one with two black and one card. They don't have like a fist of ironwood to make my infiltrator's mage mark any better.
I don't have my opponent beginning upkeep step set. I think I forgot what I was playing, but I think I was getting low on clock. It was very good he didn't have an early play, because with my deck list, I knew I wasn't going to have an early play. Wow. Dows for that's fine. Hexproof, good old uh, Bloodthirst Enabler. Hopefully he doesn't have a last gasp. He didn't show it to me last game, and the last game was pretty long. Long, <laughs> that's what she said. Do I even cast anything into that? To get a flash foliage. Well, what I'm not gonna do is cast my five drop, because um, he could rune boggle me. He can't, um, what's, what you call it, overgrown tomb thingy, overrule, he can't overrule me because he doesn't have white. If he had a reman, that would have been fine. He becomes a 3-3 frog until other turn, nice. It's a lot of lands, but he, uh, apparently he has a lot of lands too, otherwise he wouldn't uh, have such a weak board position. So I won't be hell bending that much sooner, but I've got a decent board position. Until he drops a freaking Cytoshan sh Shambler right here. Dismisser. Probably that one, right? Yeah. That's hexproof, so I can't really use the ability on the ledge walker. Ingredient. Yeah, that's bad for me. I almost want to kill my own guy just to get that not active. Tumor throw. Oh, I can't cast both my guys. Well, I can't really fight with him having a Julian Grudy in play. I almost wanted to do the Flectomancer so I can empty my hand. He doesn't have very many creatures to sacrifice to Grudian. Cast the Fist of Ironwood as I jinx it. Both pretty flooded. None of us missed the land drop yet, but luckily my uh, deck can be pretty mana efficient. Or has a way to use a lot of ma excess mana. Uh, he knows my hand. Actually, I guess he doesn't have appeal, but he knows I have the Fangtail. I don't know what I want to appeal. Uh-oh. My Savant, and then his guy. I've got nothing with... Okay, so he'll probably just choose a ledge walker. And I can still bounce after that. Right? That's fine. He's got a, a Grudian, which costs infinite to cast. And he's got uh, Omnibian... B-Combat Cyrus Shambler. Interesting. Oh, no matter, because... He knew he was getting bounced anyways. Hopefully he doesn't have some kind of uh, board sweeper. Well, I know his hand. It's the the Shambler, the the Frog, and the uh, Julian Grudian. Just like a boom boom contest. Like, no one has small creatures besides a ledge walker. Shambler, then I just... The other three get in and he kills them. So, Grudian costs six. So he can cast the Grudian and the Frog and then trade two for two. That's probably what he's going to do. And then take the other two, go to one. <laughs> I didn't realize that the bouncer was not an optional ability. I almost cast my brute pre-combat. Alright, I don't know, I forgot what the board sweepers are in this format, but that's the only thing that can save him. And a board sweeper needs a... There's no fire spout. Culling sun doesn't work. Savage Twister. That's why I should have played around. Savage Twister. By the way, if you have not seen The Help, you should go see it. I think Viola Davis is going to get another Academy Award nomination.